All right, welcome back to the Int Plus One channel. Um, we're actually playing the Sega Genesis version of Tiny Toons Adventures Buster's Hidden Treasure. I needed to take a little bit of a break. That last level got a little frustrating, I'm not going to lie. But we're back. I'd like to say that I'm sticking with it. So, the good news is that we actually get to go somewhere interesting very soon. So let's do this. Okay. It's, uh, it's the coyote. Now how? Come on. How do I know which box he's gonna come out of? There we go. This might be a little easy. Unless something just goes wrong. Boom. That guy has some huge lips. He just looks so ridiculous. Alright, alright, alright. This is actually a little easier than the first boss. No! Alright, so... There we go! I did it! Yeah! Alright, so his little uh, mind control cap came off. His eyes are popping out. And he's going... I think down the waterfall. <clears throat> hey, Calamity Coyote, are you okay? Can't you hear me? Oh, never mind. Yeah, he never talks, right? Maybe he'll hold up a sign? No? Alright, that's okay. He doesn't have to hold up a sign. We're finally moving on somewhere else. We're going spelunking. Okay, so now to a little bit more of an exotic area. Slightly more interesting. Again, those kind of remind me a little bit of Sonic the Hedgehog with the, uh, with the spike things on the chain. I know that's a completely accurate term, right? Spike things. Is that gonna chase me? It's gonna chase me! Okay. Alright. Alright. Can I push that? No! Okay. So, I can't push it. And what I think is actually gonna happen is that it's gonna chase after me. Can I... I think I see what I can do here. If I can make it happen... I can't make it happen. I could, but I don't think it's worth it. Not the amount of frustration that it could cause. Okay. Alright, so... Hold left. I'm pretty confident that that part's not meant to be... Whoa! Oh, there was a hidden area that I missed! No! <laughs> I was under the presumption that I was supposed to be able to run, outrun that. All right. Well, let's let's try for this. All right. Let's try for it. Let. All right. It's all good. I don't need it. All right. We're gonna keep our three hearts. We're going to keep our two hearts. Come on, run, come on! Okay. We're going to keep our one heart. And we're going to go in here to the hidden area. Okay. Cool. That's oh, a little mouse guy. I can't think of his name, but... uh. Alright. Now, I don't think I can outrun this, so I'm just going to jump it. That, I think, was probably the best decision. I could make in that instance. Hey, is that like invincibility? Because if so, I'm absolutely down. No, 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 no. Come on. Let me blow through the stage. I can just eat the mice. Not have to worry about it. Get, get heart. That's all right. All right, so that ran out. Okay, that almost turned out to be really bad. Because I think that they uh, full stop take your whole health. Oh, come on. <clears throat> you have to make that platform so thin that... Mm -hmm. 
right? Okay. No! <laughs> Alright. Make that platform so thin! Ah! Hey, can I, uh... I can do the thing? Oh, I can do the thing! I like that. Look at the expression on my face. Do I ever blink? I don't blink at all. Imagine all the dust that's getting in my eyes. It's ridiculous. Let's run! <gasps> no! My gosh! Are you... Wait. So how far back... Wait. Uh... I actually don't know if I just backtracked a ton. None of this looks familiar to me. Oh, yes. Yes, it does. Right, that just... This game really likes that. Oh, you made a mistake? No, we're gonna put you in a position where you have to repeat a ton of the content. You know, maybe, sh you know, should I consider editing? Possibly. Uh, am I gonna edit? I, I don't know. I think that takes sort of the fun out of it, right? So, a good part of this is that I'm doing this kind of like you'd, uh, kind of like you do it yourself, right? That's part of the fun. If you wanted to, uh, if you wanted to walk through the game, you're at the wrong place. No! Are you serious? Well, yes, it's, it's very serious. So let's see, if I go to the right, though, can I at least make some progress in the level? Because I would love to make some progress. I do not want to keep backtracking. That is not my modus operandi. That is not my goal. Hey. Can you kill that frog for me, Mr. Spike? Oh, of course not. You know, hurts me. Goes right through them. Like, they're not even on the same plane. It's game logic, right? Ah! Oh, there we go. Alright, there's Go Go Dodo. That level took a little bit longer than I'd prefer, but it's okay. style same music I am waiting for the levels with the lava those are a little bit more interesting no okay yeah we are not gonna die to that crap it's just not gonna happen today now I do like that I feel like there's a lot of really good uh, gameplay design elements in this game I mean aside from maybe the ridiculous backtracking that you have to do when you're playing through it one of the design decisions that I do totally agree with, actually, is the placement of the carrots. Because what they do is that they actually help you to know where to go. To a certain degree, right? So once you once you take the carrots, obviously you've, you've sort of taken your breadcrumb path away from yourself. But by that point in time, you've been exposed to the level enough to where you probably can remember or at least sort of figure it back out. Or figure it out again. Actually, a lot of games do that. Um, Donkey Kong Country actually has some of the best level design. And what it does is it actually helps you to learn the level by using the bananas. Because the bananas will actually typically lead you somewhere you need to go. Or show you something that's hidden. Now, I actually think that I totally hit the enemy there. Like the proper way. And uh, I was not expecting that death, actually. It's okay. I wasn't very far into the level. Now, I haven't determined how this game saves. I haven't seen anything that resembles a save point yet, so I'm presuming that this is a battery backup save. And that it'll just save for me. This is... this is my presumption, this is my hope. Uh, if it's the reality though, I am unsure. And I think after I finish this, I'm going to move on to a different game. 
Although this game is fun, I can come back to it, and I'd, I'd like to capture... <sighs> oh, alright, so it's a password. You know what? That's just fine. I'll watch the video, I'll get the password, and we'll continue on. But for now, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I appreciate any subscriptions that you give to the N Plus One channel. It'll help you keep up with what I'm doing. <laughs> and it helps me out. And in, so too, it actually helps me towards some of the goals and, and some of the groups that I support. So, 